Hello and welcome to our full length stress relieving Kundalini Triple Gong sound bath meditation class. Welcome to you in the United States and around the world, especially the UK today. I'm Sunny Hills coming to you live on Zoom and I'd like to thank you for your donations on our website sunnyhillsmeditation.com. Every little bit helps. If you're watching this recording free on YouTube, you're invited to pretend you're here with us live and participate along with us to get the most out of your experience. Or if you prefer just to listen to the gongs, you could skip ahead in the video to about the 20 minute mark for the gong bath that lasts about 25 minutes or maybe a little longer sometimes. Regarding the gongs, your sound experience is greatly improved if you can listen through AirPods or headphones or speakers, although it's not required. And if you are watching on YouTube, please subscribe to our channel if you like what you see and hear. So let's begin our class. Please now just close down your eyes and slow down your breathing. Sit with a straight spine. You can pull your chin in a little bit. That straightens your neck, straightens your spine behind your neck and relax your face and relax your shoulders if you're sitting in a chair have your feet flat on the ground if you're on a yoga mat or on the floor or on flat surface sitting in a cross-legged pose just feel yourself grounded to the earth through your sit bones and our focus as we do our opening chant and also when we do our breath meditations generally is to focus at your brow point, your third eye, your sixth chakra, the point right between your eyebrows, just inside your skull a little bit. And you don't have to fix your eyes there in any, um, you know, hard stare. You can just focus there mentally, or you can use your eyes to look there gently. Go ahead and rub your palms together. And if you're new at any time, you need to open your eyes. You can do that. Just for your own experience, it's good to have your eyes closed and your focus at your brow point whenever you can. So now press your palms together and place them in prayer pose at your heart center with your thumbs kind of in that little notch there in your sternum. And again, relax your shoulders, sit straight, straight spine, relax your face. And we'll have our opening chant, which is five words. It's actually two sentences. We chant them all together, all five words together, three times. The first sentence is Ong Namo. Ong meaning creator. And Namo meaning I bow to or I acknowledge and honor. I acknowledge and honor the creative energy of the universe. And the next three words, Guru Dev Namo. Guru means teacher or wisdom. Dev means unseen, invisible, secret. And Namo again means I acknowledge and honor or I bow. So I bow to the unseen teacher, life itself, the life lessons, the teacher, the universe. So Ong Namo Guru Dev Namo, three times through. Go ahead and inhale deeply, please. And exhale completely. And inhale to begin. Oh Namo Guru Dev Namo. Inhale. Suspend your breath. Relax your breath. And place your left hand on your heart center, your palm right on your chest at your heart center. And then place your right palm over your left. And with your eyes closed, still focus at your brow point. 
Begin to count your blessings. What are you grateful for right now, today? I am so blessed. I am so grateful for all that I have. I am so blessed. I am so blessed. I am so grateful. I am so Wonderful. And now if you could, please take a few moments to set your intention for today's class. What would you, uniquely you, what would be something you'd like to get out of this class that you could take with you into the world today and all through the week? Set your intention. Good. And I'll set my intention, or I'll tell my intention, share it with you. I intend to try not to be someone or something that I'm not, but to connect with my highest self so I can be a vehicle for truth and goodness and divinity for your benefit. I intend to play these three gongs in a way that helps you helps you to keep chipping away at any trauma or negativity or stress or anxiety that may be lurking within your subconscious mind to help you release stress and anxiety, to create a clear and open space for love and joy and gratitude. And above all, my intention today is to see you and to treat you as being the treasure that you are. So let's make this another great class and start off with some very easy stretches or warm-up exercises. Begin with, let's just go ahead and inhale and sweep our arms up overhead. These are called aura sweeps. And then sweep down as you exhale. Eyes closed, focus your brow point. Inhale up. And exhale, completely sweeping down your arms through your aura. Then inhale up again. And exhale down, being gentle with yourself, being kind to yourself as you are being here. Inhale up, this time stretch up and suspend your breath. Stretch, stretch, stretch. And exhale and relax. And I must say, I'm very happy that you are being kind to yourself by taking time to come to this class today to relate to your higher self, to your divine nature. So important, so wonderful to do it together in a group, a group of loving, supportive people. It's fantastic. So thank you for being here. Okay, our next exercise, let's go ahead and do some spine flexes. Inhale, flexing your spine forward, arching your back so that your chest comes forward and up. And then exhale, rounding your back. That's the whole thing. Just inhale forward and up and exhale back. You don't have to go to extremes, just warming up your spine, inhaling forward, exhaling back. Try not to flip-flop your head. It's not like the yoga cat-cow where you flip-flop your head. This is mainly just a spine warm-up to create some, sp some fresh cerebral spinal fluid. So inhaling forward and exhaling back at your own pace. Keep your eyes closed. Focus at your brow point, your master control center. You're in charge of your body and your mind. You control both. They are here to serve you. And they're magnificent, but it's you who are in control. So just a couple more at your own pace. And then inhale forward and suspend your breath. And relax your breath and relax your spine and just sit for a moment. And we'll just do two more easy exercises. That we normally do these four, it seems like. They're very easy and good for warming up your spine. So this next one, if you're new, you can look. The, you just put your index finger and your thumb together on each hand, and you have your other three fingers floating free. And that's called Gyan Mudra. Gyan means wisdom. 
another kind of uh, variation of guru, which means teacher. So take your arms and have them be out in candelabra pose. That means both of your upper arms are parallel to the ground and your forearms are pointing up. And again, with your eyes closed, although if you're new and you need to have them open to balance yourself, that's totally fine. And inhale, twisting your torso and your head to the left and your arms too. And then exhale, twisting your upper body and your head to the right. Inhale, left. Exhale, right. These are spinal twists and you just keep going at your own pace. Warming up your spine with this spinal twist, inhaling left and exhaling right. You can use a mantra if you like. The mantra we use primarily is Sat Nam. Sat means truth, Nam means name. Truth is the name. Truth is the name of the Creator. Truth is the name of the oneness of all. Truth is reality. Truth is your identity, you and I. Our essence is truth. Sat, and then silently nam to the right. Inhale, sat, silently exhale, nam to the right. Just a couple more. Again, these could be at your own pace. And go ahead and come to center. Inhale to the center. Suspend your breath. And relax your arms, relax your breath, and just let your arms rest now. After that, let your spine rest for a few moments. Focus at your brow point. Be aware of your breath. It's slow and under control by you. You can slow down your breath. And now we're going to do some shoulder shrugs. Really easy. Just inhale as you shrug your shoulders up, squeeze up, and exhale, relaxing down. Inhale, squeezing up, and relax down on the exhale. And do that at your own pace. Some people like to do it quickly. Some people like to do it slowly. Again, when you move your spine, your shoulders, your neck, and your head, you create naturally fresh cerebral spinal fluid. And I've mentioned many times that if you read about cerebral spinal fluid on Google, you'll read that it is automatically replenished. Your entire supply is replenished four times every day, every 24 hours. So we're just creating some extra with these little simple exercises so we can do our breath meditation and our layout to the gongs with some fresh cerebral spinal fluid. So go ahead and inhale up and hold Squeeze up, squeeze, 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 suspending your breath and relax your breath, relax your shoulders and just sit being aware, aware of the present moment. Good. And you can just continue to sit with your eyes closed. We're going to do our breathing meditation now. We call it our pranayam, prana being the life force that's carried to us and through us as we breathe. And last week, as you remember, we did the um, slow, deep breathing. Yeah, up to one time per minute if you were able to was just breathing as slowly as possible as you possibly could. Today, our breathing exercise is the 10-10 breath. And it's done with all the inhales and exhales through your nose. The pattern is 10 sniffs on the inhale and 10 puffs outward on the exhale. And as always in this class, if at any time you need more air, just take a breath and don't worry about the, the practice. Just get the air you need, and when you're ready, you can begin again, no problem. So right now, just go ahead and inhale very slowly with 10 sniffs in through your nose, like this. And then out, same thing, 10 puffs out, 10 in and 10 out. Just practice that a little bit, and you can you can count to 10, that's totally fine, or you can use a silent mantra of your choice. So if you use Sat Nam, that would be 
each word five times, like sat nam sat nam silently sat nam sat nam sat nam on the inhale and the same thing on the exhale or you can use any mantra that you like if you have one that fits a 10 10 breath or you can make it fit so go ahead and begin now breathing through your nose i'll go ahead and start our timer we're going to go for five minutes so go ahead and 10 sniffs in and 10 sniffs out at your own pace half done. Less than two minutes to go. Keep going. Four seconds to go. Notice how you feel. more 
Please inhale deeply and suspend your breath and exhale and relax your breath. Keep your eyes closed, stay centered. You can keep breathing slowly or you can breathe normally, it's your choice. The idea is to sit and take time to feel the effects that you've just created by taking control of your lungs. Good. Now please find a place to relax. It can be in your chair or you can lie down with your palms up. Lie down on your back for a gong relaxation. It could be on the floor, on a couch, in your bed. You can fall asleep in the gong relaxation. It's totally fine. But the idea is to relax your body. I'm going to give you a couple minutes before I play a minute or two for you to relax each part of your body. And as the gong is playing, see if you can stay relaxed and maybe be aware of your breath being slow. And a question came up last time about what if a negative thought or negative memory comes up? Well, that's great because that means it's coming loose from your subconscious mind and you can release it consciously. You can just let it go. This is a time for releasing unwanted thoughts and painful memories, regrets, traumas, anxiety, worries, stress, fear, guilt, all that negative stuff that no longer serves you. And when you let it go, it creates a new open space for you to choose love, peace, joy, calm, gratitude. So now take the time to relax your feet, your legs, your torso, your arms. Just go section by section and begin relaxing your body.
Consciousness. Wiggle your toes and your fingers. And please take your left hand and touch the top of your head and say out, out loud three times, I bless myself. I bless myself. I bless myself. Beautiful. And now please place both palms over your eyes and open your eyes into your palms as you slowly move them away from your face to acclimate yourself to the light in the room. And when you're ready, go ahead and rotate your wrists and rotate your ankles if possible. Good. Waking up gently. Now stretch your arms up overhead and stretch your body the entire length from toes to fingertips. Just stretch, stretch, stretch. The best stretch of the day. Take your time and stretch one part, one arm, then the other, one leg, and the other, any part you want. Just stretch. been sleeping you can yawn <laughs> okay go ahead and relax your arms down and if you're lying on your back bend your knees and bring your feet in a bit with your feet still on the ground and 
Take your right palm and put it on the outside of your left knee and push both of your knees to the floor while you twist your upper torso and head to the left to get a nice cross body stretch and relax into that position, that nice cross body stretch for a few seconds. Just breathe and enjoy it. And then go ahead and release that. And the opposite would be to take your left palm and place it on the outside of your right knee, pushing your knees toward the floor to your left as you twist your upper torso and head and shoulders all to the right. And relax into that stretch. Just enjoy it. It's not to be severe, it's just gentle. And then go ahead and relax your cross body stretch and come back to center. Good. And rub your palms together. Okay, so now go ahead and stop rubbing your palms together. We'll do more of that later. <laughs> and just go ahead and bring your knees to your chest and wrap your arms around either your shins or the backs of your thighs and curl up into a ball with your, bring your chin toward your knees. And now as you're curled up in that ball, if you're laying on the floor, just roll side to side and massage your lower back and then roll lengthwise, massaging the entire length of your spine spine as you roll back and forth and if you are sitting in a chair just take your hands and massage your lower back and be nice to yourself for a few seconds and when you're ready you can roll on up into a seated position or drop to the one side and push yourself up into a seated position and Sit like we did at the beginning of class with your spine straight, your chin tucked in a little bit, and your shoulders relaxed. Feel yourself grounded to the earth. Good. All right. And go ahead and recall your intention that you set at the beginning of class. Recall your intention and either affirm it or modify it and be ready to take this beauty, this choice of yours into the day ahead, into the week ahead, as only you can. Good. And now we'll bring our class to a close and this time this is the last time we'll rub our palms together. Just rub your palms together. Create some warmth. Sitting up straight. Press your palms into prayer pose. Thumbs into your sternum. Focus at your brow point. And we'll bring our class to a close with the sunshine song sung three times through. First time, sing it for yourself. Second time, for your friends and family and everyone in our group. And third time through, sing it for Mother Earth and for all life on Earth, and in fact, the entire universe. If you don't know the words, you can hum along or you can just listen and emote. Emote these beautiful thoughts and feelings first to yourself, then to your family and friends, and the third time through to Mother Earth and the entire universe. So I'll sing. I know you're muted, so you can sing on your end. Go ahead and inhale, first time through for yourself. May the long time sun shine upon you, all love surround you, and the pure light within you guide your way on. Inhale, this time for your friends and family. May the long time sun shine upon you, all love surround you, and the pure light within you guide your way on. Inhale, this time for Mother Earth, all life, and the entire universe. May the long time sun shine upon you, 
All love surround you and the pure light within you guide your way on, guide your way on, guide your way on. Beautiful. Now three long sat noms. Sat meaning truth, nam meaning name. Inhale. So. Truth is the name of all reality. Inhale. So. No. Truth is your identity. Inhale. So. Truth is who we are. All right, beautiful. Now, please take a few moments to say a silent prayer. Use your power of prayer for good. Wonderful. Go ahead and bring your prayer to a close. Take a few moments. And receive my prayer for you. My prayer for you today is that you are grateful for your power of prayer, for your ability to focus and send loving, healing energy to others and even to yourself. I pray that you carry love and joy and compassion in your heart and in your mind and in your words and actions. May you be animated with love, joy, and compassion in all you do today and always. Love is who you are. Joy is who you are. Truth is who you are. Love and blessings to you and your family. Satnam. Amen. Thank you for being in class today. I'm going to stop the recording and we'll have our sharing time.